Hey everybody, welcome back to Big Daddy's Barbecue Pit. This week, we're coming at you with another dessert. We're doing a blueberry buckle. Stick around. Okay, we're going to start on this blueberry buckle. First thing we're going to do is, here we have a cup and a half of AP flour, two teaspoons of baking powder, and a teaspoon of salt. And we're just going to mix this real good, just to combine. We're going to set that guy off to the side. In this bowl, we have a cup and a half of, of uh, fresh blueberries. To that, we're going to add one tablespoon of flour. And what this is going to do, it's going to keep our blueberries from sinking in our cake. Well, at least it's going to help them to not sink. So we're just going to coat these, just toss them. You can see how I got them there. Just coat them real good like that. Set that aside. The next step we have is three quarters of a cup of sugar, quarter cup of softened butter. We're gonna add the zest of one lime. To this, we're gonna add one egg. Okay, now we're gonna cream these together. Okay, we're gonna take our butter, lemon, and sugar mixture, and we're gonna put that right into our flour. Now we're gonna add our milk into it, and we're gonna go ahead and mix it again. So we're gonna start off real nice and slow on this. We have a half a cup of milk here. We're gonna add slowly to it. And this is what our batter should look like. And now we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna fold in our blueberries. And you're just gonna, you don't wanna crush these up. So you just kinda wanna toss these all guys all together. Just kinda fold them in. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and make the topping for our blueberry buckle. So we have a third a cup of flour, a third a cup of brown sugar, one third a cup of white sugar, two teaspoons of cinnamon in them. We have one tab of cold butter, or one tablespoon, and then four tablespoons of softened butter. We're gonna combine this until crumbly. So this is what your topping should look like. We're gonna go ahead and put this on top. We have an eight by eight greased baking dish. We're gonna stick our cake batter in. We got our oven preheated to 350. This is gonna bake for about one hour. Just wanna spread this around nice and even. Now 
Now we're gonna take this topping, we're gonna use our hands, we're just gonna crumble it on top. So you just wanna kind of layer it. This will kind of give it a coffee cake kind of topping. You don't have to cover it completely, just try to get it covered as much as you can. Looks pretty good. This is going to go in the oven, 350 for one hour. Okay, we're going to, we got our blueberry buckle here. We're going to cut, see how this turned out for us. Okay, we're going to try to get this piece here out. Oh, it broke. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and try this blueberry buckle. You can see our piece kinda fell apart a little bit. That's all right. We're gonna give this a try. Mm. <laughs> mm. You hear that crunchification? That's some good stuff right there. Man, that makes it. The lemon in this, the taste of the lemon from that zest we put in there, Unbelievably fresh tasting. Blueberries, of course, were fresh. Mm. That freaking cake is absolutely killer. You got to give it a try. Make sure you check out our strawberry shortcake recipe as well we have out. And make sure you hit that subscribe button. Get you some. Oh, Bill. It's like real light, though. That freaking crust on there.